had to walk down the hill. Feed my granddaughter's cat. She was gonna be out of town last night and asked me if I'd feed them for her. And listen to these guys, they're like, they can't stand it if I pass them and don't give them something. <laughs> Hi, girls. Yep, out in the sun, and it's gonna be 45 or 50 degrees today and 60 tomorrow. So they're out enjoying the weather. Look how big mama's getting. You're getting to be a big girl. You're going to have babies here soon. Frank's up there. He's not very happy either. He says, they talk to me all the time. Where are you going? <laughs> Three little wide bodies. <laughs> oh, you guys. It's a shame the grandkids are down for spring break. And, uh, She's not due until the end of next week, so she, they're going to miss it again. They missed having kids last week, or last year, by less than a week, and they're going to miss it by a week this year. I guess I'm going to have to do a step up my breeding program a little earlier so they can catch some uh, baby goats being born. Hey, Frank. This fence has been wonderful. He hasn't tried it at once. Now one time he accidentally got a little close and it, 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 it pegged him, but he doesn't bother it. Yeah, do you buddy? Yeah. Well, this is my new Tennessee home. It's a short video. Just kind of, I can't wait till it warms up just a little bit more and then I'm going to bring the grandkids out, let them run for every, whatever they can do because They've been pin, pin, pinned up for the last two days, and they need to get out and exercise. And then I'm going to try and do some garden work. Talk to y'all later.